If the opening night party is any indication, Outfest 2022 is off to a spectacular start. And the importance of this celebration of queer culture and cinema is not lost in the party atmosphere. It's our voice. You know, as artists, we get to um, tell the stories that reach into the hearts and minds of people and can change the molecular structure of that space. It's an LGBTQ plus film festival, but it's for everyone. Mm -hmm. That's what's really important. It's for everyone. That rainbow flag is for everybody. And that's what we're here celebrating. Everybody's included. And I think that's why this is so, so remarkable and so important. Outfest spotlights filmmakers and content creators who might otherwise go unnoticed, tapping into a pool of talent overflowing with creativity. There is an incredible amount of energy that has now transformed into over 200 films. Huge stars like Julianne Moore and Kevin Bacon and Rosie O'Donnell and Kathy Griffin that are all coming to do incredibly, like really, really beautiful segments throughout the entire festival. Representation matters and it's really important in this day and age and particularly um, with the times that we're in to make sure that we are strategically advocating for LGBTQ plus stories to make sure that they are being told. Celebrating independent film and queer filmmaking is crucial in the landscape that's um, increasingly trying to lock us out. Outfest has been going strong for 40 years and I think that we are more robust than ever. For a 40th anniversary, an organization like Outfest needs to, to pull out all the stops for its film festival, its namesake festival in the summer. And I think we did that. 